Na kwa jua tuangwa nguvu, mina ito presenta Ali, your entertainment PA The A is always for amazing, leo ni kona mgeni ambaye siku zote You guys always request me to call him back, tuzungumzi mambo ya mausiano One and only, Alan Lawrence, ina kwa jibro? Thank you so much for having me and yeah. I don't take this uh, chance for granted. Uh -huh. yes. Yeah, last time to listen to Mumzia, you know, types of men uh, you shouldn't even think of dating. Yes. And the conversation was very amazing. When yeah. I was in Mumza, mm. you know, to Kujetena. Yes. And today, uh, someone requested us, you know, to do uh, how to get over your ex. Yes. Yeah, because I, I, at some point, I know, yeah. you know, nine, uh, fifty percent, over fifty percent, yeah. they have their exes, yeah. and uh, over twenty percent here, you know, machine how to get over their exes. Yeah, ukweli kapsa. You know, number one thing is, uh, it, you have to reach to that level of uh, forgive yourself of what happened because <laughs> the 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 separation or rather an ex does not define you because your value has to remain no matter what happens around you, no matter what. Uh, people will be telling you because once you live your life uh, pegged on people's opinion and pegged on people's validation any slight misunderstanding you have with this person will tend to put you down so people need to reach that point of forgive yourself by all means you know forgiving yourself it's easier to say but how do you forgive yourself you go back and reflect like uh, you reconnect more with with yourself spend time with yourself validate the person in the mirror because today a little kahapa nikwambia like the way you are good the way, but if you've not told yourself how good you are and how eloquent you are and all those kind of things so no matter what i'll be telling you it does not matter so what counts the most is you are, are you are you ready to forgive yourself of what happened what happened happened does not define you yeah yeah and how do you forgive yourself <laughs> <laughs> you know, if, uh, in most cases, in a kuanga raisi sana, wakati let's say, kama umekosana na mtu, ni raisi sana kublem. You have all the chances and all the reasons to blame the other person. Yeah. You get. But uh, do you get real with yourself? Do you get real with yourself? Maybe you say, uh, at this point, up and in the course, at this point, may maybe I will, uh, like, uh, I was, I was the one on the wrong. And you just have to be intentional even take a book and a, a book and a pen write it down be why because you are looking at a point maybe next time you'll come to date so not unless you heal from this thing you will repeat the same things in the in the, in the next relationship or rather you'll use the, the next relationship as a rescue mission from yourself you'll use the next relationship as a rebound when I like I, I i'm getting into this relationship to revenge for what happened in the previous one oh. so you have to write them down yeah yeah, the people about, you know, if they want to forget their exes, mm. they, they say, what any date mungine? Uh. You know, Ali, uh, you'll agree with me. If you see somebody, uh, he thinks or she thinks she's ready for a relationship, desperately and an need a relationship, that person has a past that they have not healed. So you have to heal first of all before you move on to the next relationship. Because if at all you got you got it wrong from the previous relationship, most definitely you get it again wrong in the in the in the next relationship. Because patterns will tend to repeat themselves, and patterns will never lie. So not unless you be intentional, I'll repeat, not unless you be intentional to be able to forgive yourself so that you fully heal and move on to the next relationship mm -hmm. yeah and you know what makes some exes i'm just wondering yeah <laughs> some exes come back in other people's lives uh, and you just need to be very careful some exes come come back to you so that they can prove to you and uh, and and like now waku heartbreak binoma kapsa 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 so hukumaliza uh, kapsa because <laughs> this person remember you are emotionally vulnerable to them they literally understand your weaknesses they literally understand your fears so the moment they come they will come to fulfill the assignment they had in the very first place so my my caution to each and every person listening and to us is be very careful the moment an ex can comes back. Come back yeah like although some can come back genuinely because maybe they have realized their mistakes but you know it's a very tricky position to be in uh, whereby when this person comes come Leona come on, he left you or she left you what makes you think that this time round he or she will stick permanently is blocking your ex something you know that will block them from <laughs> coming back to your life and probably mm. help you forget them it takes a, a high level of maturity because we have some people who they have broken up with their exes and yet they are good friends so it depends with the level of maturity and the level of friendship you guys are having but the most important thing is you have to redefine the relationship who are we in the first place because if you are taking the relationship so casual you will end up being a casualty of the same uh, circumstances that ever happened so it is a, a tricky position to be in 
especially the place where emotions were, you know, you are vulnerable to each other. Uh, it's a bit technical. Mm -hmm. So uh, it, it, it varies. It varies if this person is mature enough to handle the relationship, like you need to handle the, the relationship without strings attached. So it, it depends. Yeah. Wow. Would you, would, is there, is there like, uh, mm. is there a, like a step by step thing yeah. which someone can just a guide, yeah. which someone can follow? You know, to just forget the. Uh, yeah. Because I think when someone is, <coughs> is uh, rooted, you know, in that situation, mm. mm. they normally wish that you know, ningepewa, mm. ningepewa a manual mm. so many of you. <laughs> yeah. Is there is there a way that you know mm. people can can follow you yeah. know to be able to forget their exes and move on in their life? Uh, the first thing is acceptance. Accept that whatever happened happened. Yeah. So accept and uh, the reality kwamba mambo kwa ground ni hivi. Umsali ni acha. Na wao kiacho achika kwanza. So hiyo acceptance. So after acceptance you go to forgiving now yourself that is forgive yourself and uh, and 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 now do not go, do not think that uh, everybody is bad out there just uh, uh, just after after that forgiveness then also now look at a point of uh, surrounding yourself with the right network yes. surround yourself with the proper friends who are going to challenge you who are who are going to believe even in you more and uh, do not put everybody under the same uh, blanket and be like everybody is bad at the end of the day life must continue because some people come into into our life to like as a lesson so you need maybe they that was their season in their in your life so that they can be able to prepare you maybe for the next relationship so do not uh, say that uh, do not put a hold to your love life Ma life must continue kama tu mtani wanasema ulie tu kama ambulance like ni maisha ya songe mbele so ulie tu kiendanga mbele so but take time to grieve take time to grieve mtu wa sikuambi do not try to to rush to rush the process you to be accept then forgive yourself then surround yourself with the right networks people who talk positively about relationships because not everybody is bad we have some good people out here so yeah and Pia, uh, you, is, it's, is it advisable you know, to use someone to forget your ex? <laughs> not really, because if you use someone to forgive your ex, you are not forget. to forget. Yeah, you are not even real with yourself in the first place because you will be like, you are using that uh, relationship at the very onset as a rebound as uh, like uh, you will just t tend to bleed on this person and yeah, this person did not hurt you so do not do not uh, consider the next relationship if you've not healed from the previous one and how can you know that you've healed if you see this person on the street can you conf uh, like can you can you comfortably say hello to them like without anything so that is the moment now you get to understand if you you, you are ready to move on but take time do not just move to me to your relationship kunini like you are running away from the reality so be real be real yeah, yeah. amazing conversation we we had uh, right there with uh, one and only Lo alan lawrence who is a relationship expert na ni jamaa you know you can always reach out to him with rooms and i with mambo ya relationships kama unasumbuliwa na mtu fulani kwenye mambo ya uhusiano unasaidia pia hiyo yeah yeah we do yeah, yeah by the way kama kuna one mwenye ni reach out from um, dubai uh -huh. yeah, and we are working with her journey, and it has been amazing yeah mm. wow so uh, Issues what is the yeah, issues. Now, where we issues? That is why they say a man, a man who is in authority, you must be under authority. There is no person if if you are going to make it in life, you have to have people who you look up to at the end of the day. No man is an island. It's only people who try to rush the process that treat their late. Why should I say so? Because I need to have people who I'm accountable to and uh, I'm accountable to the one and only Robert Burale whereby here and there and um, thank you so much for the calls you normally call. Hata nikiaka post via the mbia pana, yu umefanya ujinga sana. Yu umechoma. So you need people, I've always said that um, in this life if you don't have a mentor, you are free to be tormented. Oh, amazing. Mini tuwa presenta Ali, your entertainment PA, nyembeni mnataka tumlete tena, nyembeni kama mnataka tumuzi mingine uh, content gani, nyembeni mnataka tumuzi uh, topic gani. That was a topic ambayo imekua requested by one of you guys. Thank you so much for the love, thank you so much for the support behind the camera. Ni mwanangu nguvu, anaitua Eric Mukawa. Anaitua presenta Ali, your entertainment PA, na siku zote, mtaka kufanikiwa, mtaka kufanikiwa.